Did you know you can find World War II imagery on Google Earth and see even places like London and Berlin? Let's take a look. Hi everyone and welcome back to Let's Geolocate. I'm Ben and this is round three. So settle in, get your maps ready and let's get started. First up, we're going to have a look at London in 1945. Google Earth is primarily satellite imagery, but what we have over London, if we scroll back to 1945, is aerial image of that area. Here we can look around at that aerial imagery from 1945 and see what London looked like there. When looking at a place like St Paul's Cathedral, we can have a look at what it looks like now, and then what it looked like back in 1945. You can see some of the areas are a little bit different around there. Obviously, a lot of things have changed. Previously, when I was looking at this area, I was also having a look for photos that might have been taken as London suffered significant damage during 1945. So for example, here's an image found on Wikimedia of bomb damage in London. We can see St. Paul's Cathedral right here, and we can actually see some of the areas where there's only foundations left on the ground. We can even have a look and see if we can see that same image. I think the location that we're looking at is this area right here. And you can see that would have been some of the damage as well. This is quite fascinating and I'm sure there's plenty of other locations that we could even look at to see what they look like during World War II. Another area I want to look at is Berlin. What did that look like during World War II? This is what modern day Berlin might look like. Scrolling back, we can see here's a aerial photo from 1943. It looks like we've got more as well because we can see 1945 and 1953 as well. The next one is obviously 1985. So it looks like we have a number of images. This is one area that I find quite interesting. Zooming in, in 1943 aerial imagery, we can see what looks like an airfield right here. You can see that this area suffered significant targeting with bombings. We can see the craters all around this area. If we scroll through to 1953, we can definitely see that area is not the same as what it was in 1943. Berlin and London are not the only cities that are viewable like this. We can see there's an area just outside of here as well. You can see this race field that looks like it had significant targetings in 1945, 1953. It was a little bit more patched up. To see other cities around the world, you can see just how many there are. Dresden. Hanover, Dusseldorf, Frankfurt, Nuremberg, we can see as well. There's also Paris and there's a number of other cities. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you're a war historian or a war buff, I highly recommend you check out some of these images as there's some incredible stuff to be found by looking through Google Earth around the 1940s.